when you feel bitter, here's what the scripture says. Luke 15 11 to 32 Luke 15 11 to 32 is the parable of the prodigal son. In this story, Jesus tells about a father and his two sons. The younger son asks for his share of the inheritance early, which was like saying he couldn't wait for his father to die. He takes the money, leaves home, and wastes it all on reckless living. Eventually, he runs out of money and is left with nothing, even having to feed pigs to survive, which is about as low as it gets. Realizing his mistake, the younger son decides to return home, hoping to work for his father as a servant. He feels he doesn't deserve to be called a son anymore. But when he gets back, his father sees him from a distance and runs to him, filled with compassion. The father hugs him, gives him new clothes, and throws a big party to celebrate his return. This shows how much the father loves his son, despite his mistakes. The older son, who stayed home and worked hard, gets upset when he sees the celebration for his brother. He feels it's unfair because he never got a party even though he was always faithful. The father explains that everything he has is also the older son's, but it's right to celebrate because the younger brother was lost and is now found. The message of Luke 15 to 32 commonly known as the parable of the prodigal son, is about God's unconditional love, forgiveness, and the importance of repentance. It emphasizes that no matter how far someone may stray, God eagerly welcomes them back when they turn to him with a repentant heart. Additionally, it warns against self-righteousness, and highlights the need for believers to extend grace and compassion to others. This parable teaches us about forgiveness and unconditional love. The Father represents God, who is always ready to forgive us and welcome us back, no matter how far we've strayed. The younger son shows that we can always return to God, no matter what we've done. The older son reminds us not to be self-righteous or resentful, but to rejoice when others find their way back to God. Luke 15 11 to 32. Remember that, when you feel bitter, 